Peshtigo fire is, is entitled after, named after a Peshtigo, a town across the Green Bay, where there was a terrible fire. It was at the same time as the Chicago fire, except it was far more perilous. A lot more acres of land were consumed by this fire, and many, many more people were killed than in the Peshtigo fire. This is in 1879. During that time, Adele was already here. Remember, the apparitions happened in 1859, 1871, excuse me. It happened in 1871. Adele was already here. She was. She had a little chapel here, a little uh, place for school to teach the children as well. And <clears throat> all the neighbors came because this was a horrendous fire. It moved very fast, strong winds, burning their, burning their houses, their barns, they're killing their animals. All the trees were scorched. It was like somebody set off a bomb in this area. And Adele was here, and all the neighbors came in to, to stay with her because they thought perhaps Our Lady would protect them. Well, they were right. They took the statue of Our Lady and walked around the parameter of this property and prayed that there be a divine intervention through the intercession of Our Lady of Good Help and that somehow this fire die down. And as they prayed and they prayed and they prayed and they walked this whole territory with great faith. Now, can you imagine all around this area, there was this huge, violent fire burning everything and killing lots of people. The ones who were gathered here were gathered in faith and belief that the Blessed Mother would protect them. All of a sudden, it started to rain and the rain snuffed out the fire. And there's reports that the fence that was around this property was scorched on the outside but left white or left whatever color it was on the inside. We haven't found exact proof of that, but there's a lot of uh, rumors or stories about that. At any rate, the point is the same, that the Blessed Mother protected this place. She wanted this to be preserved for perhaps hundreds and hundreds of years, and it's our gift and our legacy and our opportunity and our challenge to be able to make sure that this place is preserved in a beautiful way and that we enhance this place so that many, many more people can come and learn this story and draw closer to Mary, who draws us closer to Jesus.